Hey guys, it's me, Life Summer, and welcome back to part, part is this, I believe 28, of the Sims 3 Supernatural Let's Play. Uh, when we left off, Luke was kind of just, uh, heading home, I believe, yes. He, uh, well, I mean, that's Xander. Luke, <laughs> I was hitting it off with Bella, I believe that's her name if I'm correct, or something like that. Bailey, ba Bailey Swan Swain, I think. He came a three-star celebrity from just kissing her and making him his girlfriend. Um, Odessa came here, and she's about to blow. Her stomach's huge. She will be having this kid soon, probably this part. I'm just assuming. Now, I am addicted to one video series, and I'm usually never addicted to anything. But I just have to tell you guys, I am addicted to Aeon. A lot of you probably know what that is. Um, it's basically a series of The Sims 3. You know how I like to do the talking and it has like all the drama in it? I've never really been into those until I watched this one. It's called Aeon. I believe that's how you pronounce it. And I can honestly say I was so addicted to it that I spent... 10 hours, that's a long time, 10 hours just watching the videos, till I completed the whole entire series. That's pretty addictive. And I still want to rewatch them. That's crazy. Like, you know, I'm addicted. I'm addicted. I am freaking addicted. Hmm. My goodness. It's a little scary how addicted I am. <laughs> Okay, so, um, <laughs> Odessa's hungry, so I want her to go into her fairy home and everything. She gets Pollen Punch out of here, which in case you don't know, Pollen Punch will fill her, um, hunger up right away. Hello, Mitty Max. We actually need to purchase her some pet supplies so she doesn't, like, destroy everything. Um, let's see what we can get her kitties a scratching post that's pretty essential and a toy I guess we'll put all the stuff in Raven's room cuz Luke purchased her but it's more of a uh, Raven's um, responsibility cuz I got it for her the litter box will even go in her room <laughs> Actually, the litter box will go outside. I don't know. Just put it outside. And we'll get him a little fish bed. A kitty bag. Um, where can that go? Right there. And, um, excuse me, Caleb. What are you doing? You're really freaking creepy. Caleb? Caleb, what are you doing? Get out of the bed. Like, no. Your bed is definitely upstairs. Creep. <laughs> and Raven's gonna go to sleep. Odessa's going to drink some pollen punch. And she is exhausted. So, of course, um, right after she drinks some of this, I will send her to bed. It fills her hunger up really fast, as you can see. Alright. So now I'm just going to go ahead and send her to bed. She might as well just head to bed. Okay. Everybody head to bed really late. Really late. But uh, Xander will be the first one to wake up today. He's the one that went to bed <laughs> at a normal time. Everybody else just went to bed and it's 6 a.m. Mm-hmm. So I will get back to you guys when somebody wakes up. Bye. Okay, so Luke's awake, but Caleb also has school in one hour, so he barely got any sleep, but hey, it is what it is. And now he has scouting after school. He has it, um, what days? He has it today, Monday, Tuesday, and Thursdays. Um, he doesn't have it Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, and Sundays. So today after school, he'll go to scouting from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. 
then he'll be able to come home. So that's good. He's a level zero, so he will be able to hopefully get up uh, his skills and whatnot for scouting. Because he does want to master it, right? I think so. So, I don't know what he's eating. Um, what is he eating? Deep fried cheese sticks. Mm. So Luke's off to work as well. Bye. Go. Leave. I'm serious. Leave. Get out of here. Alright, well he's about to leave. And Mitty is about to lay inside her little cat thingy. <laughs> it's so cute. Alright, and Caleb is off to school as well. He is in his werewolf form heading to school. How cool is that? Um, yeah, and Xander just woke up. Morning, Xander. Uh, <laughs> does he have a game or something today? No, he has work in seven hours, though. So he's cooking himself some breakfast. I wonder what he's making. He made himself some deep fried fish. He'll enjoy that. Because he's a werewolf, guys. Remember that? Did he not grow up? <gasps> he didn't grow up. He didn't blow out his candles. <gasps> Look. Oh my gosh. What is this? Why didn't he do this? I can't believe this. Okay, so we have to quickly um, have Xander blow out the candles again. <laughs> Bonnie, what? Watch him do this again. Because <laughs> you didn't do it before. Alright. The baby is coming. The baby is coming right now. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, go to the hospital, go to the hospital. Quickly, Xander, Xander, quickly. Hurry, Odessa's off to the hospital, come on. Xander, Did, don't tell me it canceled it again. I, what? Here she is, on a broom. Flying to the hospital. Well, yep, here she goes to have the baby. Let's hope it's a girl. <laughs> and he's off to the hospital once again, not aging. Mm hmm. Speed time up. We'll just wait and see. <laughs> Let's see. I'm pretty excited. Oh, it's a baby boy. Yay. <laughs> mm, okay. Um, yay. <laughs> no. Um, it's a baby boy. <laughs> um, Well, he's been born with a clumsy trait, and we get to choose his second trait. What would we like to name him? Well, so the name I chose, I looked at the comments on the one of the videos, and I picked Gavin. I like that name. And we will have him have the loves the outdoors trait, because if he's a werewolf, he will love the outdoors, and if he's a fairy, he will love the outdoors. So, welcome to the family, Gavin, even though you really were supposed to be a girl. But we'll love you anyways. Oh, he's so chubby! He's chubby. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's see if he's a fairy. Okay, Odessa, this totally looks wrong. 
Anyways, let's see if it's a fairy or a werewolf. He is a werewolf. Nothing goes our way. Nothing. This makes me sad. Nothing goes our way. Ever. Sims 2 LP, we wanted a boy. We got all girls. Supernatural LP, we want a girl. We get all boys. <sighs> My good gracious. This is one thing, people are like, have the watermelons. Have some watermelons. I'm like, if I have a watermelon, it's going to like reproduce three girls. I don't want three girls. I just want one kid. So, we got a boy. And it's definitely not wanted, but, um, it's a boy werewolf, and his name's Gavin. This is pretty sad, guys, but, um, hey, it is what it is. We have a baby, and that's all that matters, and he's chubby. I don't know why, but he has such a big head. And he's chubby. <laughs> so, with that being said, having a new child requires new furniture, of course. Um, so what we're going to do is um, take Bone Hilda out of here, and we'll go ahead and put her in the arcade room. And we'll take the weightlifting crap, whatever, and um, we'll, uh, <laughs> we'll torture Luke with this. He has the perfect little spot for it. And this will be the nursery, and since Gavin is a boy, we will do boy stuff. Uh, we will do blue wallpaper. <laughs> and we will do... Like, wood tiling. And then I will go ahead and put some furniture in for him. Yay! He will have a panda crib. And I will, um, fix that to have it blue. He will have a baby swing, because he's a baby. It will be blue. <laughs> and, um, for now, he doesn't really need too much, especially since we don't have a lot of money right now, <laughs> if you get what I'm saying. Um, but one thing I do want to put in the room is a lounge chair, um, for our Dessa. So Odessa can sit in there with him. We'll put in a rocking chair. How about that? That'd be nice to have. A nice rocking chair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, you know what? Let's make Luke's room green. It's less of a hassle for me to have to recolor everything. I'm a lazy person. Um, I know that Caleb's room's already green, but we might as well just do it. Um, I don't know. I like the color green for boys. I don't know. I think it just, it's cute for boys. I just think of green. When I think of blue, obviously blue is definitely a boy, but I also think of green because a lot of little boys love green. So I will get him his baby swing and I'll just put it in the green color. Plus the green one's cuter. <laughs> And I will go ahead and grab the rocking chair. Place that. I guess in the middle of the room. <laughs> Can I... There we go. No, that's like sticking out. That doesn't look right. right. We'll just have it like that, I guess. Even though it looks crazy. We'll leave it like that. I, I guess. I mean... <laughs> there, we'll just shove it in the corner. And we will also get a rug. We'll get him a bunny. No, those are all kind of girly. We will just get him another bluish, greenish rug. Like we got, um, Caleb when he was born. And we will, uh, ba 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 do a green wall. Fun. Okay, now we have 576 simoleons. Whatever. 
Um, I'm pretty sure the baby was hungry in the first place also. So we will give him a bottle. And welcome him home. Yay! Give him a bottle and um, snuggle with him. Change his diaper and then put him in his new room. Wait, is he... He is hungry like the beast he is. And then we will put him in his crib. Or we can maybe rock with Gavin. Yes, we can rock with Gavin. This is a really cute, cute, cute feature that I want to show you guys. Um, they can rock with their children. I think it's the cutest thing ever. Honestly, watch. Wait till you see it. It's not really, like, too cute, but she's just rocking with him. I think it's so cute. It's not, like, the swing or anything. The baby swing over here. But it is really cute. And she'll just put Gavin in the swing. Or in his crib. That works, too. And she stinks, so she's gonna go shower. And then she'll go downstairs and make herself something to eat. I think she'll, um, serve... Or deep fry some. No, she'll go ahead and serve some deep fried corn dogs. Oops, wrong, 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 wrong. So, Luke is home. Luke is home. Luke, Luke, Luke. He will go ahead and invite over uh, Bailey, his girlfriend. Um, <laughs> invite over next ranked chess opponent. Opponent. Nice. Um, he'll ask her out on a date. Bailey Swain. And he will take her to... To, to, to... The Red Velvet. Seems like a fun place for a vampire and his date. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Meet you there. Okay. So we're going to go ahead to the Red Velvet Lounge, even though Luke is exhausted. Maybe he has a, an elixir on him for that? No? Well, we're going to go there anyways. <laughs> See how long we can stick around without passing out. Is he thirsty? No, he's not thirsty. This is... This spot is the place to be. So, obviously, this place, I guess, today is pretty popular. Um, I guess this is the place to be. Alright, where is his date? There she is. He just walked right past her. Go say hello. He's going to give her a hug and... Whoa, something's... Oh, yeah! We turned her into a vampire. The effects have been taken on her. As much as I can say. It's happened. He'll kiss her and... Shall I kiss her? <laughs> Girl! Don't even. <laughs> what? <laughs> Caleb has earned a badge. Oh my gosh, you know what? Screw you. We're leaving. Goodbye. Go home. She's such a little... Won't even accept a hug. Screw you. I've had woohoo that lasts longer than that date. Oh my gosh. If you're going to ask me out, then you should actually spend some time with me. Well, when you're being abroad and not even letting me hug you, uh, how about a uh, no? What a little... Mm. Anyway, guys, this is the end of this part here. Um, <laughs> um, so yeah, nothing really happened in this part, I could say. Um, he was about to get in the cab. Okay, so anyways, um, look at her running because of us. Remember that. We helped you. You didn't do that by yourself. Anyway, 
Um, yes, this is the end of part 28. I think this is part 28. Hopefully. Who knows? <laughs> so, I can't wait for my graphics card to come in. Is anybody else excited? I know I am. Um, so, yes, I'm going to link Aeon down below. Comment there. Life Simmer sent me. Um, so, don't forget to thumbs this video up. Don't forget to comment below. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys for 3,200. Yeah. Uh, so, I love you guys so much. Bye.